Boxing King Media in association with Boxro. John Bowser, have I pronounced your pronounce your name right? John Bowser. Bowser. A huge, huge opportunity for yourself. You've been in this situation before, so I'll quickly mention that fight. Michael Williams Jr., uh, a year or so ago, you fought him. He was an undefeated prospect and he wasn't even close. You, you blew him away in a few rounds. Uh, how much that, has that done for your uh, your credibility and just getting your name out of there? Because he was on top rank. Cutting her again, sorry. Like, what, what, what did that do for your, you know, you as a fighter, you know, your credibility with the American boxing fans uh, when you knocked out Michael Williams Jr. in about four or five rounds? Well, when I fought Michael Williams, it was more like a statement because everybody thought I was going to lose. I was the underdog in that fight too. And, you know, I just came up and did what I had to do. The reason I started with that fight was because I interviewed Richardson a few moments ago and, and he basically said he doesn't give you any credit for that win because he feels uh, you was just way too good for him before the fight even started. So it was a bit of a compliment for yourself as well. I mean, every fight is different. So, like, um... Just depends on who I'm fighting. That's how I go. So basically, when I fight, um, Richardson is different too. You know, every fight is different. They move different. They have different styles. So you know, you could say that because you know, he's a different fighter as well. It's very rare for fighters uh, worldwide to risk their O's, especially when you're under 20 fights. Unless the money's huge or the opportunity's huge, uh, why is this the right fight for you at this time? I mean, I just feel like it's time for me to like step it up a little bit, you know, step to an next level, so I could be able to to fight for a world title. So I feel this is the, the 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 big chance that I have, so I have to take it. You obviously are, we met about four years ago back in California when you were training with Robert Garcia. You know, you was there sparring Virgil Ortiz, Lindolfo Delgado, some big names, really good fighters. That sort of sparring, how has that prepared you for for this moment? Yes, of course. Um, those type of fighters are the, the fighters that helps you to to grow. You know, fighters that already have four for championship bouts and those type of fighters are the ones that push you to, to be greater. And what can we expect from John Bowser? Because last time you literally, when I saw you, you blew Michael Williams Jr. away. It was a different type of fight. This guy is probably going to be more technical. Are you looking to go in the same sort of mentality to go in for the knockout or are you going to try and box him? I mean, everything could happen. You just have to, to watch the fight and you'll see. <laughs> Richardson's expecting a boxing fight because he's saying he knows you from the amateur days. He knows your, you know, your uh, your credentials are really good. So he's expecting an end-to-end, -end, you know, fight where you're both going to be thinking. I don't know. We'll see. We have to fight. <laughs> Uh, and just a quick one, uh, I would like for the fans to get to know you a little bit. You know, outside boxing, is this what you've been doing full time, or do you, do you work as well? You know, how has box, you know, for you to get to this moment now, has your journey been in short? I mean, uh, this, this is my job, this is my only job, this is all I do, boxing is my life. He fought a Puerto Rican in his last fight and he's saying he's, he's probably not going to have many Puerto Rican fans this weekend, so I'm guessing all the Puerto Rican people are behind you to, to get the W. All the Puerto Ricans are going to be behind me, so I'm really glad that I'm going to be at Madison Square Garden fighting at a Puerto Rican um, May event. John, appreciate your time, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.